This is a really quick video that shows students how to join and take part in live lessons on Microsoft Teams. Okay, so a teacher will schedule your lesson in advance and you will get an email to say that a lesson has been scheduled and you'll be able to RSVP to that invite just by clicking on the email and accepting it. It will then disappear from your inbox. To access the live lessons, therefore, you will go to your calendar in Teams. So in Teams, down the left hand side, you've got a calendar option and all of those invitations that you accept will then appear in this calendar. So you should find all your live lessons ready to join straight from within this calendar. So to join a lesson, you just click on the lesson and you click join. You can also join lessons directly from the team channel where the, the lesson has been posted by the teacher. So I can see this lesson's actually already started. So I can join it here, or like I said, I can join it from the calendar. Okay, when you join the meeting, you'll have a few options. Uh, your camera should be switched on, but you can change the background using the background filters. Blur is acceptable if you're not happy with the, the room that you're in and you don't want people seeing what's behind you, but please do not pick any other custom backgrounds. You should join the meeting muted, so turn your microphone off. The teacher can unmute you or you can unmute yourself when you need to speak. Make sure you've got your computer audio ticked uh, and then you are ready to go. Click join now. When you're in the meeting, you've got a few options. If you want to ask a question and you're muted, uh, you can click the raise hand button. That will tell the teacher that you've got a question you want to ask, okay? They, you'll get a little uh, marker next to your name so the teacher will see that you've raised your hand. The chat option is available, but do note that, that the chat is everybody will see what messages are posted there. Pupils and students cannot delete messages or edit messages once you've posted them there. So think very carefully before you put something in the chat uh, and make sure that it's appropriate for uh, online behavior. And you can toggle the uh, mute option at the top here. You won't by default be able to share your screen uh, as an attendee, but the teacher can enable that if you need to do a presentation, for example. You can change your view. The teacher may spotlight themselves so that they're the main view. If you need to see everybody in the lesson, you can choose what's called the large gallery view. It is important that during lessons that you keep your camera switched on, that you engage directly with the teacher and that you contribute to the lesson as if you were in class and that you uh, look respectable. Remember that Teams is being used all over the world in business as well as in education and the skills you're learning here in terms of how to use Teams and how to behave appropriately in a video uh, meeting are going to be really, really important. Um, whatever happens in the world, we know that this aspect of working is going to stick around. When you're ready to leave the lesson at the end and the teacher has dismissed you, you'll be able to just leave via the red button at the top. Meeting recordings from the teacher will then appear in the channel for, the, for you to review at a later date or if you couldn't attend the live lesson due to a time difference or an absence for another authorised reason.